HBO has finally confirmed the Game of Thrones prequel series, A Night of the Seven Kingdoms, The Hedge Knight. Shooting and production have started for the series and casting has also happened for the main characters so, let's start knowing them. The Game of Thrones prequel series The Hedge Knight is based on Martin's popular Dunk and Egg novellas trio. The series is set about 72 years after House of the Dragon and 90 years before Game of Thrones. It is set to premiere in late 2025. The series is based around the characters Sir Duncan the Tall and his squire Egg. In the books, a hedge knight is a wandering knight who lends their sword to those in need. They are called hedge knights because they are so poor that they sleep under hedges and in ditches and stables. They have little money and no family name, so they spend what they have on armor and a horse. They compete in tournaments to impress a lord and win a prize or be accepted into their household. Dunk didn't have a privileged upbringing. He grew up as an orphan in the poorest slum in King's Landing, Flea Bottom. His earliest memories include growing up as a street urchin in the Flea Bottom alleys with friends, Ferret, Rafe, and Pudding. The lot of them would sell or dump questionable pieces of meat to pot shops of Flea Bottom that sold thick stew known as Bowls of Brown. Dunk became a squire for a hedge knight known as Sir Arlen of Penetry whom he met in King's Landing. Arlen died of a chill in 209 AC on the way to Ashford, and Dunk gave him a burial on a hill. After that, he took possession of Sir Arlen's chipped garnet and three horses including the warhorse, Thunder, and decided to compete in the tourney at Ashford Meadow in his place. Dunk meets a bald boy with indigo eyes at an inn in a village near Ashford. He mistakes him for a stable boy and trusts him with his horses and leaves. After returning from his meal, he sees the same bald boy mounted on his warhorse and chastises him for being a thief. The bald boy says he's an orphan and insists on accompanying Dunk to Ashford as his squire. Though Dunk rejects the first time, he agrees to take him as his squire for the tourney the second time at Ashford. Dunk's name is also associated with the Trial of Seven that occurred in 209 AC after he came in the defense of a Dornish puppeteer, Tan Seal, and struck her attacker, Prince Arian. According to the Wiki of Fire and Ice, Duncan's champions included Sir Robin Rissling, Sir Humphrey Harding, Sir Humphrey Beesbury, Lord Lionel Baratheon, Sir Raymond Fossaway, and lastly Baylor Targaryen himself. They fought Arian, Daron, Makar Targaryen, Sir Willem Wailed, Sir Donal of Duskendale, Sir Roland Craycall of the Kingsguard, and Sir Stephen Fossaway. Dunk's side emerged victorious and he was absolved of his charges. Prince Baylor sadly died in the Trial of Seven. Makar wanted Agoin to train as a knight and offered the Hedge Knight a place at Summerhall as Egg's mentor. Sir Duncan, however, refused his service offer and laid down the condition that the young Prince Agoin take the road and learn by braving hardships along the way. The young prince donned a wide-brimmed floppy straw hat while squiring for Duncan. Sir Duncan the Tall went on to become the Lord Commander of King Agoin's King's Guard. He was also the king's closest friend. Sir Duncan served as the Lord Commander of the King's Guard when Sir Barrist and Selmy started to gain prominence. King Agoin married Betha Blackwood in 220 AC and had five children together. He named his firstborn son in honor of Sir Duncan the Tall. Duncan Targaryen gave up his claim to the Iron Throne to marry a mysterious peasant woman known as Jenny of Old Stones. Agawain's reign coincided with the beginning of a harsh winter and many of his measures angered the High Lords of Westeros who had a chokehold over the peasantry. Without the deterrent effect of the dragons, he was forced to compromise with them on several issues. In 259 AC, Agawain V attempted to hatch dragon eggs, and it went nothing like Daenerys' attempt on Game of Thrones. Duncan Egg's lives ended when a great fire broke out at Summer Hall. Agawain, his son Prince Duncan, Sir Duncan the Tall, and several courtiers perished in this great fire. The tragedy at Summer Hall left the castle in ruins. Peter Claffey will play Dunk, or Sir Duncan the Tall. He's a former professional rugby player turned actor, and he's tall. Not quite as tall as Sir Duncan the Tall, but still plenty tall. His readings were terrific. Martin thinks that the audience is going to love him. Claffy has appeared in Vikings, Valhalla and Bad Sisters. Dexter Saul Ansel will play Egg, or Agoin V Targaryen in the series. He's got an amazing amount of experience for his age. According to Martin, he cannot wait to shave his head. His auditions were wonderful as well. Ansel has appeared in Emmerdale in The Hunger Games, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. So, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, please do us a favor. Like the video, share it with others, and also subscribe to the channel because the bigger the channel gets, the better and faster the videos will come. Thanks for watching the video.